five axis cycles can be difficult to apply in some circumstances. The aim of the five axis operations inside EdgeCam is to quickly and easily create a basic five axis toolpath. More advanced options are available if required. In this example we're looking at a, a curved surface typical of an aerospace application. It's nothing flat on this surface, it's curved in both directions. On a three axis machine there would be a need to use a ball mill and scan the part. However, using five axis techniques we can improve the cutting conditions and reduce the cycle time dramatically. So in this example we're going to create a start point, we're going to pick the surface as the drive geometry and then apply a few basic parameters inside the edge cam five axis finishing operation. As you can see we've got a big step over in there of 6mm and we're going to put a lead angle of 5 degrees onto the tool. Pick a bullnose tool, so we're using a 12mm with a small radius, 1mm in this case. And as you can see the toolpath is applied, nice smooth toolpath and if we simulate you'll see that the tool is tilted forward slightly by the 5 degrees we defined in the operation. If we zoom in a little bit, see a little more clearly the tilt on the tool and the contact point, which is the important thing, is the front edge of the tool. Let's simulate this now and see the machine kinematics. So as the tool approaches, the part is positioned and then edge cam takes over with the five axis motion creating a very smooth efficient toolpath. Thank you for your attention I hope this short video has been of interest to yourself.